Hello everybody, I'm Dan here from the Hammer Game Channel and welcome back to another achievement run where today we're going for the achievement a New World Order, I think it's called. Yes, the New World Order. Make all nations fascist. Now, yes, we are playing as Germany because I think that's probably the best way to go about doing this. And I guess what we're going to do. We're going to start doing bloody this so that we don't have to worry about America causing any trouble for us because we just, we just don't need it. The UK is going to be bad enough to take as it is. So there might be some extra achievements we take along the way, such as Operation Sea Line, which is occupy all of the uh, British homeland. Um, so we we'll, might do that. Uh, yeah. Just thinking, do we want to just go straight for the Rhineland? I think we'll just jump in the four-year plan. Actually, let's go for the treaty with the USSR first, actually. Right, first, I need, I need to sort these out. Oh, yes, we, we need to sort the Navy out as well. We do not care about these. Be gone. Navy is going to be one thing we really need to spend a lot of time on during this. We'll grab you. Grab you. Do I have any submarine layers? Ah. Oh. What we'll do is we'll change you up. There we go. Much better. A lot of production in those right now because, well, I want to start sinking some, you know, putting mines down to stop naval invasions. Right, so we've got a lot of guns. Artillery needs to have a lot more than that. So it's sort of support. Tanks are going to be our best bloody friend this playthrough. We'll go ahead and grab those. Tactical bombers can uh, shove it. And we'll go for bombers instead. Right, there we go. So, I'm just going to take Poland now, actually. I'm actually very tempted just to start justifying on them. Do you know what? We will once we have the political power to do so. Because then I can just... Try and get in the Stalin as quickly. I think Stalin needs to fall first, and that will be pretty good going for us. We are currently using a lot of fuel. Why? Oh, the army consumption. So it's got to be gone in four years, but that's fine. But because we're using all these guys, that needs to change to the Panzer. And that cavalry can change to infantry and can the mountaineers. Yeah, I think it would be nice going for Poland, actually. Just just take Poland now, and probably just try and get Stalin as soon as, really. There's Stalin out of the question, you know. Happy bloody days. A uh, Gunther? Obviously, Rommel will be used, but we'll get Manstein and Heinz first, then we'll get Rommel. Or do we get Rommel? We might just have Erwin. Erwin, come here. Sorry, Rommel. You're just going to be chilling today. I'll send him over there, and we'll also send the four tanks. Infantry isn't 100% perfect. That is what we need, and you as well. Alright, so that's all sorted. Let's get my cal computer in. Panzer template is just pish. Yeah, it needs to be double that near enough anyways. There we go, we'll just sort that out now. Alright, so we take out Poland. We're not actually just the final one yet. There we go, 250 days. It just caused 11% tension. Uh, but that's fine. Boo. Um, just try and get them to flip as just quickly as possible, really. Um, we'll try and just take out Stalin. I just think that's the best way to go. Just get, get rid of Stalin, then start building up an army just to conquer all of the uh, Balkans that remains. Um, if they do join the Allies, then we'll probably just destroy France, hopefully. Um, do we want to go and help with that? 
250 days away, so that's done. So hopefully the Russians, well, the Soviets rather, are going to say, well, thank you. Yes, we will take that. Yeah, we'll send two divisions over. Rommel can have a wee bit of fun and fun over there. Yeah, the Soviets accept, of course. So do you know what I'm actually going to go do? It? Get away and give us the bloody Panzer. We're going to have the Panzer III in 236 days. How bloody amazing is that? Oh, we almost forgot about the Mephil bills. And let's demand increased Dutch trade. Let's, we're going to demand that all. I'm going to try and see if we can just flip them. Because obviously... They, what do they need? They need at least 25 points and 15 more than... We might just try and force them to go with us. I think we bloody will. Yeah, hello. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm just gonna keep befriending you. Oh, we're in Africa. Not Africa, Spain. Yep, this is Africa. Welcome to Africa. Go ahead and do the bills. We got bills to pay. We got Rommel in charge and we'll put the field marshal in charge of him. Go ahead and try and demand some well, they went for some as well. Trade war time, boys. Trade war. Let's go and help try and take out the lot that's been cut off in Barcelona. And for the war economy, we cannot do. We want to grab A. We could go with Himmler. I think we're going to go with Martin Bormann. I would go for Rudolf Hess, but he is going to take his... Uh, he's going to do his flight at some point, so... There's a point in wasting 150 political power. A guy that's going to not even stick around for the entire day. So let's go ahead and do Autarchy. There's no point in West Wall until we've remilitarized the Rhineland after all. Try and push our way into Barcelona. And that'll be them completely cut off from like supply. And then we can just focus on taking. So once that port falls, that's it. They're cut off. Their link has been severed. That's about to happen. Fantastic. Oh, as you know, their divisions are just pants when one single panzer division of mine can just push them out. Ah, yes. Lovely. Yeah, we've got a nice speed circle in there and here actually. That's pretty good going. That would be the best thing for us if the Dutch caved to the Germans. That would be lovely. They need to cave to us. They will be ours. Get into them. Shall we kill these Soviets instead? Yes, we shall. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing, Franco, you donkey? Turkey's done. Probably try and do that, actually. Let's go and try and align both of those. I'd happily take them as puppets. How's fascism over here doing? Fascism over in America is doing pretty good. Pretty good. And we're about to get to 25, which is going to put us in a position to actually go ahead and do this, because we are 15 points ahead. Will be 20 at that point, unless they are doing it right now as well. Yeah, we need that mobile warfare doctrine. Right, let's get up and finish mopping up this. Yeah, with our help, they should be able to take them. Oh, yeah, definitely now, surely. Yeah, the, I think I think we've helped Franco win this. Don't think we'll tears. No, we can't. That's disappointing. Do you know, I think they've got that covered. We're going to go. Stop attacking. Come over here. We're going to try and take Madrid. If not, I might go down here and try and zip my way through here and cut off um, a little group down there. Uh, where are we? 
Oh, we're here already. Nice, Madrid. Nope, we're not going to be able to push in Madrid. Right, we'll do is take a wee nice wee gander in here, punch through there. Cut off Granada and Almeria. I think that's a good idea. I think I'm going to do a line Romania before I do a line Hungary because, well, they're going to need a little bit more push to go fascist, so. Ah, the Dutch! Are you going to please do. You can do it. I know you can. I know you can. It depends on if the AI said to not take it. Oh, they're finishing the Nordust boulder. I think I've said that right. No one corrected me in my Dutch playthrough, so I presume so. And we are down here doing our little thing. We were down here doing our little thing. We have done our little thing. Lovely. Oh, uh, but I'm afraid. We're kind of ready to go. We, I completely forgot we were just fight on Poland, actually. I don't even think we have enough divisions right now. Oops. Completely forgot about that. Completely forgot. Do you know what? Abandoned ship we use. We're going to leave that to its fate. Is we shall go ahead and bend that. Draw a proper line in like that. How long do we have this for? The war goal? 25th of February. Well, hopefully we can get some more divisions out in time. I completely forgot we were doing that. I think 36. They only got 11 factories. We got 41. We, we are out doing them. You better go fascist. Oh, the most glorious tank is now available to us. We could go and do that, but that would be bloody pointless. We'll get some anti-tank. Infantry expert. Lovely. What we need to do is actually get them into bloody production and just start hammering them out like there's no tomorrow. I want 30 factories on them. Right, so we'll go 25 first. There we go. Are those eight finished? They are out. So they have 50... We should be fine. I'd like to think we'd be fine anyways. I do apologise to Spain though, because they're going to lose my support. I don't think they're going to really miss it too all too much, but... So we'll just stop exercising actually. I know these guys are going to be a little down and out right now, but I don't think they'll be too bad. And with them taking out prison first, they're going to be absolute plebs and probably not hold as well. That's the plan? We'll see. Anyways, I think we're good to go. We'll have to worry, we'll have to worry about the uh, bill payments to begin with as well, actually, just thinking about it. Right, we just need to go bloody aggressive. We do not need to hold back here. Ow, they mopped up house prison pretty bloody quickly. They really did. They must have had the uh, their cavalry divisions on there. There goes our line Romania. We've not even done Rhineland yet. Got line Hungary as well. They've returned home. My tanks. Get onto the front. We have a job to do. Your job is to re-secure house prison. Right, it's going pretty well. We've only lost 13,000. We are seeing a little bit of um, resilience against us right now, but there's that's because of some rivers and stuff, I guess. Things seem to be going fine in the south, actually. In a way, I guess. That is absolutely shambolic. How are we doing equipment wise? We are still good. Really just need to get across this bloody river. Yeah, let's get into them.
Okay, we are racking up some casualties. Might just see if we can stop pushing for a second, just kind of recover. Send some additional stuff that way. Might be able to get across. Just gonna keep my eyes on these guys because we might be able to get them in circle, possibly. They shouldn't have attacked. Yeah, they've screwed themselves now over here. Oh, we're actually over now. I really don't think they're going to be able to hold them. They can go. That's probably why that's yellow, actually. Let's get elastic defense. Oh, they're doing what I thought they were eventually going to do, so that needs to be quelled right now. Alright, let's get back into them. We can probably get a war economy. No, we can't. War support is not in our favor right now. Where's Gorbals? Could grab gorbals, it would help us. Um, let's grab the Herman Goring Verk. Chinese United Front's foreman. I'm going to drive to Warsaw. To Warsaw, minions. To Warsaw. Or around Warsaw. Oh no, not around Warsaw. Actually, no, no, that's worked fine. Okay, the pinks have done a dumb bets, which I'm thanking the tanks for rather than the infantry. I really get them right, the production as well. You die, you die. Right, National Spain won. Good, 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 good. That's always good to see. We're going to lose about 100,000 to Poland, I think. I don't know if that's good or not. Is it good? Is it good? I guess in a way it is. Yeah, there goes Poland. So what do we take? Do I just take it all? What would, what would the tension go up by if I just took all of Poland? We could just take Western, I guess. Indian puppets is the rest. And we could liberate both of those. Poland. Ah, there we go. Good old Eastern Poland. Alright, so that's a good start for us. We have made a lot of world tension so far. Um, what we'll need to do is just go ahead and get Gorbals, actually. So now we can do the war economy. Rayman has been remilitarized. We don't. We don't need to worry about uh, remilitarizing that. I believe the Dutch have let us down and haven't done the fascist route. So they haven't done any yet, which I guess is good. We should probably go ahead and just buff that back up again. Plenty of army experience now, which is good. Which means I can go ahead and change these medium tanks. Because we're going to have our medium tanks. Alright, Japan's doing their thing now, which of course is just going to make the world tension go much higher. Do we want to go to the anti Soviet pact? We could go for that actually. I think what we want now is that extra research slot. Probably grab West Wall. And we get anti tank in. We're a decent little bit short of that. Although we are doing a lot in terms of... We do not need that much, surely. That's all... Whoa, whoa, whoa. All of our consumer goods. Oh my days. We need to build some more civvies. We're going to war economy as soon as. Because, wow, that's bad. Oh, do you know what that's... Because of you. The bloody bells. They'll be gone soon. They'll be gone soon. That's okay. Um, don't know why I would do that. Really? 
You're going pretty nicely fascist, which is good. Do, 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 do. What do we want? We want maintenance companies. We'll have an integration pack with you. We'll have an integration pack with you. So they're both getting aligned by us, which means they are getting some daily fascism. Good old, good, good, good. America is looking pretty good. Looking pretty good for fascism right now. I could even befriend Poland. I guess we'll bypass that. Yeah, we can bypass that. Good. Right, Methyl Bell payments is gone, so we're back in business. We are back in a business. KDF wagon is done. Extra research lot time. And we're doing medium tank wise. Yeah, we're a bit short. And we're short of anti tank as well. All we'll do is we'll probably pump the brakes on the tanks a little bit. Just so we can actually sort out the infantry. But I think the infantry is a little bit more important to us. Right, war economy, because we've got 54% war support. Um, we do kind of want to start building some fortification on the Soviet border as well, just to get them to, you know, grind on me for a little bit. Right, let's go for Armored Spearhead. We'll just spend some uh, army experience to get that faster. We've got a Polish division. I do not want your Polish division, thank you. Dancing War. I'm just thinking, did we take all the right Polish land? I think we did. Right, we need to start making some divisions. So we're just getting a batch of 24. Because our army is currently at... Yeah, that'll... I'll dump out of those. I'll dump out those divisions and we'll be able to do Angelus. Um, right now, I guess I'll do West Wall. We are probably going to want that uh, fortification in place. I'm, I'm hoping the AI is going to decide to do that. Right now, we're stopping them from doing anything. But it's a shame I have pumped 120 political power into that. Du, 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 du. I'd love to go for that, but I'm not going to. How the hell do you have a non aggression pact with the UK? Explain yourself, puppet. Explain yourself right this moment. I'll give you some bombers. Go ahead and build some fuel dumps. As well as some synthetic refineries. I'm really hoping America is going to flip. And they are 43%. And who knows what America is going to do. They should hopefully be flipping pretty soon. Hungary will definitely be joining us at some point. Right, sorted. Nice, we got a batch of 23. And there's Erwin back. They're just going to all go on that border. I think we'll have to worry about the allies as such. It's only if uh, the Czechs tell us the bugger off that's, that's really going to become an issue for us. Let's get ready to the MP38. Oh, we can't. Eat. The other one's still doing its ting. Weapon the incident. Attack. Much loose. Why oh why? Hell. Map are reinforcing all possible at the location. 
Oh. Okay. Why? They are with me. I could just take them all, to be quite honest. Uh, 71 military factories. That's 65. Which I guess isn't disastrous. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to waste any more political power on doing that. Right, you just come over here right now. I want them to be feel... I want them to feel threatened by me. Alright, well, all those forts got sorted out quite quickly. Um, I'll go ahead and build some more civvies, I think, as well. Okay, we're a decent shortage of stuff right now. There's no point doing that trade deal thing with the Dutch. Probably eventually going to join the Allies. Who wants to join us? Ah, oh, Romania, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. You're probably going to stay whole, you're just going to become a puppet. Hungary as well. Yay, Anschluss has happened. And here comes good old Romania, not Romania, Hungary. Let's integrate the war economies. Because why not? Let's put the squeeze on them. Nine more divisions, of course. We don't have any equipment for them right now. Yeah, we're short of some stuff, that's fine. It's kind of triggering me having an odd number of divisions there. We'll go ahead and get uh, Heinrich. Upgrade those as well. It's going to be quite nice getting. Um, I guess we'll help Yugoslavia, I might get them to join us. Um, with that done, we could go ahead and do that. I feel like we should probably go ahead and demand this to death and land. 41% world tension. They're gonna eventually, they're gonna probably tell me to bugger off. That really will be a pain in my backside. All those guys exercising. Oh my days. I only need three years to get the supply. Oh, we do not have enough. We do not have enough supply refineries right now. Hungary is a puppet, and so is Romania. Lovely. Demand is the Detton land. Just in case they have any issue with that, they're completely bloody surrounded. Of course, the Allies would step in, of course. Oh, we already had unlimited exports. Jesus. Right, we'll get Erwin. He is an army uh, genius. Or an armor genius, sorry. Cannot not take him. Yeah, tungsten's becoming a real issue for us. Oh, 47% boys! Come on, do not say no, give me it. We're staying historical here. You need to give me it. Look at the access right now. A good start. Yeah, I don't think they're going to be... Going fascist, I don't think. Boo. 
B, B, B. Tam on je, goodbye, goodbye. The fourth international. Good for you, Stalin. Yay! We got to the land. Woohoo! A French Britain announced their, you know, alliance. Yeah, you idiot. You shouldn't have accepted that. More everything that's currently in production, just more of it all. Right, so we'll probably say goodbye to Czechoslovakia before today's episode will end. Um, or we can maybe, well, yeah, we'll do that. Research Eastern Claims, probably get Memel Katowice. Where the hell's Katowice? Not familiar. Is that Katowice here? That's Banzig. Katowice. Alright, okay. That'll be nice, we'll get the claims on all that. Um, do we want to go up to extensive? Oh, we've got to get a Blitzkrieg theorist. Now, Hungary will not be getting any of Romania. Just saying that now. We're, we're probably not going to see Greater Hungary. Yeah, they're not really liking us too much. That's sixty percent we've got. It only cost it, eh? so I guess it's two. I've never noticed that before, idiot. All right, the first Vienna award is done. Let's do the fate of uh, Czechoslovakia. I well, think I might go ahead and give um, the whole of Slovakia just to uh, Hungary. I think possibly. It's going well so far. I don't know, it's a little bit ahead of myself. We'll go ahead and grab that. Fuel gain per oil is going to go up, which will probably help us. Still short of any tank. 98 days away. I do want to start getting some more troops out. Luckily, Stalin hopefully... Um, well, they can go. He can demand Poland. He can't exactly go to war straight with them. He can demand the land. But um, he's going to get through Poland to get to me, and I'm not going to call him in anytime soon until I'm bloody ready, so good luck to him. I'm just waiting for an American Civil War to fire. Because that is 50 50. I think support might just be slightly in favour of the fascists. Um, yeah, I think it's time for an extensive conscription. And it's time to say goodbye to the Czechs. Oh, sorry, the Czechoslovakians, rather. Well, I can request their entire force as well. 38 divisions. How many you got? 17. That's not too bad. Yes, come on. Goodbye. Come on now. Ah, let's put the squeeze on him. Ah. Really? Really? Why? Oh my days, that's going to trigger me. That's actually going to trigger me. Oh, I might just have to liberate the whole bloody Poland just to... Why? Why would you do that to me? I 
that's looking good. Progress is doing well. There's a bunch of bollocks there, though. Oh, it's so bad. Yeah, trade with the US ain't gonna be possible. Oh my days, 56%, come on, just flip. You know you wanna go fascist. Oh, I don't even know if they'll, can they, can they even hold, I don't even think they, they can hold referendums, I don't know why I'm doing that. It's probably gonna fling them into a civil war, and if it does, we'll be going over the hell. I'm pushing Z, why do you have so many divisions already? Let's just get 12 batches in production. Right, we'll do this and then we'll call it a day. Hopefully I can just, are they cores? Gains a claim, don't know if they're cores. No, oh, they're in the colonies. Bollocks, bypass. We can do a run the measure now. Um, yeah, we'll grab that. One three hundred percent reasonable for synthetic resources. Jesus. I, I'm gonna have to do it, guys. I'm actually gonna have to liberate bloody Poland. Just a real pain in the backside. Just to, you know. Get rid of that stupid Zal. Was it Zal? Zalzi. They got control of. Why? I'm going to fucking do regrouping. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed, guys. Thank you very much for watching, and I shall be back very soon um, for some more. So yeah, take care. Cheers, bye for now.